What up boys and welcome back to another gold farming video. So in this video we're going to be fishing for a transmog item, a fish actually. And basically what you do is you just go to Howling Fjord and you fish in these waters, in these pools, like the Fangtooth Herring Schools. Uh, according to Wowhead, the fish can only be obtained in the Fangtooth School and not in the open waters. But there is, however, people who has commented in the comment section saying they, like, claiming they've actually found the transmog item, the weapon, in open waters. But to be on the safe side, I'm gonna be fishing in the pools. It's really no problem. You can use an add-on like this, like server hop, and you can just jump realms, and you can just stay in one spot, basically. And uh, some information about the weapon. Here you go, the dark herring, it's a dagger. Basically it just looks like a fish. You hold like you wield a fish in your hands. And you can see the pools right here around side the um, howling floor fjord, like stick to the pools. If any of you guys decides to try out open waters, please let me know if you actually manage to get the dagger. When it comes to price, this fish is up for 15.5 on my realm, but it averages for like 10,000 gold on average all EU realms. And I believe this number is going to go up with the wardrobe changes coming in Legion. So this is basically just one of those hunting for a rare item uh, video, because I haven't been able to get this fish myself. I fished for like 40 minutes or so. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just keep on fishing for this weapon and uh, I will leave a comment down below of how many throws I had, like what time it took me and so on. And it would be really cool if you guys did the same. Like if you decide to go and give this a shot and you actually get the fish, please let me know how long you fished until you got the fish. Uh, I'm not going to leave a gold per hour on this farm because as I said, this is one of those hunting for a rare item. You can't really put an average on this. Uh, the drop chance is like 0 0.04 or something like that, according to Wowhead. But Wowhead doesn't really have that much information about this weapon, so I'm not sure how accurate that is. And uh, that is basically it for this video. Uh, if you guys like this video and you decide to try it out, please let me know in the comment uh, down below. And I will see you guys in the next one. That is it. Bye-bye.